Hi everyone and welcome to our next video. In this video, we're going to take a look at how you can draw a rectangle using P5. So first thing is we have function set up here where we are going to create a canvas size of 300 pixels by 300 pixels. Then we have the function draw command and somewhat different than what we've seen before. We're going to actually set the background to a different color than grayscale. So I could set the background to green if I wanted, or blue, or red, or some combination of those. And I do that with the background command, and then followed by brackets and three arguments here. This one tells us the red, this one is for green, and this one is for blue. So. If I wanted to have green, this is the second one. I've got it set to 200. I could put it to 255, the maximum value, and run it. And you can see we've got a bright green background. If I wanted to change that so that it's a bright red background, we just need to change the first value here and make that 255. So if I run it, Sure enough, that's what I get. Now, I'm just going to set this back to what I had before, just so we can see the contrast here. Let's put this back to 255. So next, what we're going to do is we're going to draw a rectangle. And we do that with the RECT command. Notice that after that, we have four different arguments here. And what they represent is the first two represent the upper corner of the box. So right here, I've got a really tiny box or rectangle. That corner there is given by the coordinate 150, 150. The next argument here, this one here, represents the width of the box, so the x value. And this one here represents the height of the box, in other words, the y value. So if I wanted to make this box bigger, Simply, if I made this 50 here, and I made this 50, and I run this here, we can see that we've got a bigger red box. This corner right here is the center. This is 150, 150. It's got a width of 50 pixels and a height of 50 pixels, so it looks like that. If I wanted to move the position, Let's say I'm going to change this to 100, and I'll change this to 100, and run this again. You can see that it has shifted up here. This point right here is 100, 100. The width of the box is 50 pixels, and the height is 50 pixels. In order to fill that box with a certain color, I'm going to use the fill command. The fill command goes right before where we draw rectangle. And I've got the first value set to 255, which is red, and the other ones are set to 0. So that's how we can draw a rectangle or a square. If I wanted to make a rectangle, in this case I have a square, I just need to change this here. So for instance, maybe I want to make this 125, so that is the height in pixels so if i run that now you can see sure enough we've changed that height the height is 125 pixels so that's how you use the rectangle command that's how you can change the color of the background other than grayscale that's it for this video everyone we'll talk to you next time